you'll notice the uh, leaves the car running. No, we're good. Just recording. That's all. Just recording? Yeah. So do you want to see in my car? Do you want me no, to open the door that, for you? Sure. Okay, what, what, what is it you need to see? It's awesome. Thank you, Jody. You're welcome. Just don't let the uh, the dog get too close. <laughs> How you doing today? Yeah, it looks like you're uh, warm for the weather. You ready for December 4th? That's going to be fun. My lawyer is, uh, she's uh, excited. Yeah, so is mine. Yeah, awesome. Yep. We'd like to know how, uh, how is it that uh, you can violate the city ordinance Which by is? swearing and cussing? That's, that's an ordinance. You walked up cussing to me? No, I mean before. I mean, you you, but you did the same thing. When you walked up cussing and, me. And you uh, also. Uh, Were you cited that day? Were you cited that night? Uh, you know. Were you cited that night? I, I was not cited that night, okay. no. Well, there you go. But, you know, if you can do it, why can't we all do it? That's who, what we want to know. Who said that I did? It's, on rec it's recorded. My son did it, yeah. No, when you, you thought was a cop. You said a piece of I didn't think he was a... You called me a piece of <laughs> You said f*** you. And... <laughs> Is that okay? Is that okay? Was that lying? I mean, that's not... that In, in your capacity... In your full capacity, that that's lying? that's not you to, for you to say. Okay, so what do you, what do you want? You want me to sit here and say, I want you I to write your son. No, I want you because to say, you I, 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 you know what? I did it too. Let's, uh, if it, let's cite myself. Okay. You know, but, you you broke the city ordinance as well. But did you get cited that night? It doesn't because matter. You didn't get cited that night. It, does that matter? I got cited another night. Yeah, that was a whole completely different night. Okay, which which night. which you mis when I told you that the law that you cited me for. The, the interrupt the uh, resisting arrest was the wrong you were one. Interfering with you my you remember yeah. that? Yeah. Well, the prosecutor told me that if there Paul wasn't enough there there wasn't enough evidence to support that. That's not what the prosecutor told you because I've already talked. To the she did say that. No, she did. So she dropped it to disorderly uh, ordinance no, violation. It falls under disorderly conduct. You want to waste you the taxpayers' money? You need to learn it. Do you want to do you want to waste the taxpayers' money Good for luck, a trial? Brad. Hey, you know what? Good luck. Good luck. Okay. You can, you're dismissed. You have fun with it. You're dismissed. You can walk it away. Work that way. You're dismissed. It work we that pay way. your taxes. I, I don't care. We what pay, you pay. We pay your taxes. I don't care. You're dismissed. You work for us. No, I don't work for you. You do work for no, us. Yes, you do. No, I don't. Yes, you do. You, I pay you, taxes. You've been here a whole five minutes. So you're dismissed. In all reality, I don't work. For you're dismissed. Negative. You'll leave before I do. You'll no, leave before no, I do. I promise you. I promise I'll you. be here all day. Okay. Stand right there, then. You you stand here all day. I have nothing else better to do at this time. So go for it. I, well, I hope you don't get a call. Okay. <laughs> you're dismissed. Jody, you're dismissed. Brad, I don't care what you say. You're dismissed, Jody. You know what? You have better things to do. I have nothing else better to do. I have nothing else better to do. Do you not? Shouldn't no, you uphold I'm, I'm your hold? I'm fine right now. Shouldn't you uphold your hold? I am. Do you feel like pulling your gun and shooting me? Do you? Know you? What, do you? You need, you need to go and do something with yourself. Right. Yeah. You need your teeth cleaned. They're a little bit yellow. Maybe. They are. It's because I got to chew them out. That's right. Is it? Yeah. Or is it from the meth you've done before? I have never touched meth. Let's have a picnic. You're a joke. You're a complete joke. Is this go against your city ordinance? Huh? Just go against your city ordinance? What? Calling me a joke. You are a joke. You think so? Yep. Well, I guess that's yet to be determined. Okay. If I'm a joke, why don't you leave? I'm not leaving anywhere. Why don't you leave, Jody? Not going anywhere. Hmm. Once again, you're dismissed. You can leave anytime. Once again, I ain't going anywhere. When you leave, I'll leave. I'm not going anywhere. I'm standing right here. Hey, baby. What do you think of Jody, huh? You can leave. Not gonna happen. I'm just out walking my dog. Okay. Taking Walk. a picture of the gas that you're wasting. Okay. Walk your dog. I'll, I'll leave when you leave. If you're out walking your dog, walk your dog. I'll leave when you leave. You okay. approached me, I didn't approach you. Once again, just like on that street that night, I didn't approach you, you approached me. When? when the night that you gave me the, the stupid ticket. 
when you pulled up behind my patrol car and I have my lights I couldn't on, get I couldn't get through. That, yeah. That's, that's, I couldn't get through. That's you what. Went around. I went around you. It's on camera. I couldn't have got around you unless I went no, through somebody's you still went yard. Oh, I didn't see the lights before I turned. Well, it doesn't matter. You see the lights when you I couldn't back up on a one-way street. Isn't that what you was giving the ticket to the guy for? No, not for that. It street. wasn't. No, that was. That's not a one-way street. It's not a one-way street. No. Oh. The other street that he went down to come down that street was a one-way. Was a one-way. Yep. Okay. Anything else? There's nothing else. You're dismissed. Not going. Come on, make the walk of shame, buddy. Nope, not happening, Brad. Do it. Not happening. You've been standing here for eight minutes and forty-two seconds. That's nice. You know, I'm just walking my dog. You came out to me. Just want I some did. pictures of this great you, cruiser you got. My car. I maybe is there something? Is that illegal? Huh? Is that illegal? I just said I thought you. I'm asking you a question. Is that illegal to videotape yeah, your car? Not at all. Okay, then. The then why would you come out? That's why I opened the door. Great. Is it unlocked? It was. Okay, so you leave your car running and unlocked. No. How smart is that? It's not unlocked. Great. Is it unlocked? It was. Great. Is it unlocked? It was. Okay, you're looking really stupid right now. Am I? Yeah. Okay. You are. Okay. The best thing to do is just walk away and leave so okay. I can leave. Why? Are you afraid? Of what? I don't know. Your ego? I'm definitely not afraid of you. Your ego getting a, your ego getting the best of you right nope. now? Why don't you humble yourself and leave? Nope. You're dismissed. Not happening. I'm just saying right there's the door. There it is. City Hall. Don't there's you have a meeting or something you have to attend? No. Don't you have the bad guys to try to get? There's lots of drugs right up the street there. There is. Okay, then go get those guys. I will. When no, I'm ready. <laughs> when you're ready. Yep. Why does most uh, everybody I speak to about you hate you? Do you know that? Well, maybe you're hanging out with the wrong people. You think? Yeah. I don't hang out with anybody. Okay. I meet people on the street, store owners. Everybody, everybody up there. I can, I can, I can go from here. I can go from here to every. I can go into the post office, which I've spoken to, dislike. I can go up any one of those stores down there that well, you can I see. Tell you, what, you interview them, you get them on camera, and show me. I don't have to show you anything. Okay, well then. They trust and believe. I'm not. Why would I just lie about people a, disliking you so much? All, all I hear is a bunch of air. You have nothing to show or prove. You should think you about that. You should think about it. You I should help Rockaway. Do. You should help Rockaway. You shouldn't hinder it. You shouldn't. You, know what? you shouldn't harass. I've done a lot for this town, and you've been here a whole five minutes. I've been here for almost ten years. So. So what does that tell you when it's town getting town worse? Right? What is, What does it tell you if you've been here ten years and it's getting worse? It's worse. How's it gotten worse? It's gotten way worse. <laughs> who says I'm going to be here forever? I hope not. God, we I, need I, I, we need I, somebody I, who cares, man. I, 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 you need to move on up. You hope not. You need to move on up, man. Move somewhere else. I'm it, right where I'm at right now. You're not doing anything for us. That's what you think. That's that's what the community thinks. That's what the whole community I, I thinks. I really don't care what you think. Man. That's not what I. You, you that's not necessarily what I think. That's what through. the community thinks. That's not what the community thinks. It is. I've, no, I've interviewed over a hundred people. People that you talk to. Only. That, that so just random people. Busted or gave a citation to. Oh, come on, man. If, if you just gave a simple citation, nobody would dislike you, man. If you gave me that citation and I was guilty, I wouldn't even care. I've got hundreds of, I've, I've got tons and tons and tons of citations in my life. I don't dislike the, the ones that gave me, I, I earned them. Yeah. I was speedy yeah, and I, I, I ran a stop sign. It's, it's, it's not all about liking cops, trust me. Oh, that's because most of them are just like you, bullies. Oh. You're yeah. a bully. Because you have that badge right there, you're a bully. Yeah, that's it. That, and when that, I first moved to town, you pulled me over. I asked you why. Hall? I asked you why you pulled me over, and you said the reason why I'm pulling no, you over pulled, is because I've never seen. I never. That's a lie. Okay. I never ran a stop sign. Okay. That's a lie. Did you give me a ticket for that then? No, I didn't. Well, you should have if I did it, why? because I don't break the law. Why should I? Because it's against the law. That's no, against. It's not against the law. It, it, it's not okay. So I have you on tape saying it's not against the law. It's so I'm gonna I'm gonna run law. every stop Russ sign from now on. Every stop sign you. I see, I'm gonna run. Listen, Pull me over, and I'm taking that to court. I'm not listening. Okay. You've said enough. I said it's, it's not against the law because it's against the law. That's no, against. It's not against the law. That's what I'm saying. You said it's not against the law to run a stop sign. Yeah. What do you do besides cause chaos? You're supposed to be working what, right now. I listen. I'm paying your I'm paying your salary. 
right now. What's your definition? And you're wasting of chaos? time. Shouldn't you be doing something? I am. I'm talking to you, Brad. But I don't want to talk to you. I said you're dismissed. Okay. Well, you don't dismiss me. I can. No. You, you work for me. No, I don't. Yes, you do. No, I don't. You need to you need to really check on that. You do work for no, me. You need to put check on yourself. I don't need to check myself. Okay. You work for me. I don't work for you. Yes, you do. Oh, I just told well, you. I've got to watch my I just told you seven to times to leave. You're dismissed. That's eight. It doesn't work. Get. How you doing? Um, no, I don't need any help. I'm just here to take some photographs of the lobby. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm working on the labor department. Okay. Hey? You are from the labor department? No, I, I'm the independent journalist just working on a story on the labor department. Okay, I don't know about pictures in here. Do you mind if I get approval real quick? I'm sure it's fine. Yeah, I mean, if you want to chug up a chalk, you're more than welcome to, but I'm telling you, it's, it's all right. Thank you. Let me just... Job service specifically or the whole department? Or... Uh, just what's available for the public. Oh, okay. Sorry, who, can I ask who you uh, checked with? My supervisor. The supervisor of the... This office. All right. Can, can I ask that name of that person? Tim, hang on a second. Hi. This is our supervisor. This is super, no, I was just wondering who she checked with to make sure it was all right that I was filming here, that's all. Oh, um, we'd actually... It's not allowed. What's not allowed? So you can't, you can't film within the office. I'm going to have to ask you to leave. If you want... This is to office open, with someone this office is open to the public? It is. Well, then there shouldn't be a problem. What's your business? Me? Yes. Oh, I'm just working on a story on the labor department here, getting a view of what's available to the public. Okay. Well, we have people that are responsible for media, so if you're interested, we can put you in touch with them. Oh no, we I don't. I don't need to. I don't need to talk to anybody. In the office. I don't need to talk to anybody. Okay. Well, I can't have you recording in the office. Can I get your name? Yep. My name is Jessica. Jessica, and where were you informed that it's not allowed to be filmed in here? The public are not allowed to film inside of our office. Well, I'm not going in your office. I'm just in the publicly accessible area. I am going to have to ask you to leave. Um, well, thanks for asking, but as soon as I'm done taking the photos of the publicly accessible areas, I'll probably be on my way. Okay, well, you can leave or we can call the police. I, I mean, you if you need to call the police, you're more than welcome to, but... The public's allowed to okay. video record publicly accessible right areas because of the First Amendment of the Constitution. We have a media department. We have a media department. Oh, yeah, but I'm saying I don't, need to, I don't need to talk to anybody. I'm just going to silently film what's available for the public here. That's all. Right, but we should, we can't decide I'm just letting you guys know it, it's a constitutional right. Right. Well, I don't, I don't, we don't have to ask for our constitutional rights, is what I'm saying. I'm not trying to be disruptful. I'm just taking just what's available to the public. To Mind if I take your photo? Um, I don't, I mean, it's your right to, but, you know, if you take your phone out and take a photo during work, that your phone becomes uh, foilable. Freedom of information law, New York State law, like while you're on duty, if you take your phone out, your personal this is phone. just for my bosses, and if the police ask, just in case. Because they are going, they're being called right now, so they will be. Called. I'm just, I'm just saying, so if you, if you take a picture with your personal phone while you're on the duty, your uh, phone can become uh, subject to FOIL in New York State, which is federal, uh, New York State law. They can use my phone if something well, I mean, comes up like that. I understand. Do you mind if I take your photo? No, go ahead. Can I get clear access of your face? You take it, you do whatever you want. I'm not gonna stop you. Okay, but I need to see your face. Okay. Thank you. You can't record back there though, okay? Yeah, I'm not back there. Public area. You can't film through there. Yeah, I'm not back there. I'm in, in the publicly accessible area. Okay, but you're filming in yeah. the private area. But you can agree that the people who are in this lobby, publicly accessible area, they can, they can see back there, right? Through that window? Mm -hmm. Yeah, so you, I'm just asking you. I'm not, not going back there. I'm just asking you not to. Yeah, I understand. You guys keep asking me to leave and ask me to stop recording here, too, but it's yes, my constitutional right. As soon as you're right. finished with your business, I'm going to have to ask you to leave. What's going on?
Not too much, just working on a story on the labor department in the publicly accessible areas. I'm sorry, say that again, I couldn't hear you over here. Just working on the story on the labor department in the publicly accessible areas. Okay, um, so it sounds like they just don't want you here. It well, seems like you might be I disrupting just, their work Oh no, I'm not, or... I'm, I'm not trying to disrupt anybody. Can I get your, uh, your name is um, Mallow? Mayo. Mayo. Not, yeah. You got a badge number? 17. All right, thank you. No, I'm not disrupting. I'm just silently filming. Okay, well, if they don't want you here, so it's not really how how kind of trespass. That's not that's not how trespass law works in public. Well, if they want you removed from the property, they can have. It's just like say you were in Seven uh, Eleven or whatever. No, no, no. Seven Eleven is a is not public. Seven Eleven is a private business. Correct. How you doing, sir? How you doing? Good. So, if they don't want you here, what is the reason, like? That you want to stay. Well, what is the reason they want me to leave? Is the real question because this is publicly accessible. It's open to the public, and I'm just here in public. I understand that. Um, I don't. Did you ask them? Okay. So I, I think they got the policy. There's, there can't be a policy that trumps the United States Constitution of freedom of the press. You guys understand that. Okay. So and trespassing from public is not the same as trespassing from 7-Eleven. That's private property. If, the pri if they wanted a private property, I'd have to leave. But this is public, open to the public. A them asking me to leave, are you trying to trespass me? Trespassing in public is a secondary crime. Filming is not a, is not a crime, and being in public is not a crime. So um, I'm just going to finish off a few more photos, and I'll probably be out of my way. i got no reason to... Uh, I'm not causing a disturbance. I'm not trying to collect anybody's personal information doing their work here. And I'm not, you know, asking these guys to take time from their day to help me. I'm just taking some photographs here. And I think that they're confused as that they can ask somebody to leave public without committing a crime. Well, I, I, I don't think that's their concern. I think it's just unusual, that's all. Yeah. You know, they probably don't get that every day. No, no. You know, and I, I, I know that you probably hear piece for yourself just to kind of prove a point which is fine um, no i'm just you know here exercise my rights as freedom of the press and at the end of the day get some of the information it's just, here it's out. just unusual for someone to okay. come in and have how, a, how do you pronounce your last name Strickland. Strickland. do you have a badge number zero three you guys are both lockport police yes sir all right thank you yep. yeah so no it's I'm, just unusual you know to just come in and start filming i don't think they get that every day no, I got it, and uh, so, you know, I mean, part of what I do. As far as their policy goes, we don't work for them, so we're not quite sure what policy it is, and we certainly can look into that. Yeah, I mean, the First Amendment right I mean, to film not, in public. We're, gonna, we're not going to drag out of here and cough or anything. Yeah, I mean, that's of course not, because you know, I'd have to break a, break a law to no, be put in the handcuffs. So, Let's, um, we'll, we'll call this in. Supervisor Jessica, can, can yeah. I talk to you privately yeah. just to see what's going on mm -hmm. here? Okay, I'll be right with you. Okay. So I think the main concern was just people's privacy. Yeah, I'm not, you know, not in and I understand you, you personal seem like information. You have a little bit of respect for people's privacy. Yeah, it is a public place. Um, back here is not public. Okay, yeah, that's by appointment only. So if you have an appointment, that's one thing. If you don't, um, that's something different. Um, as far as paperwork that goes on around here, it does have people's personal information on it. Yeah, so I'm not. I'm not saying you're going off and to, no. zooming in or taking pictures of that but that's something you can't do yeah of course so um are you almost finished yeah i'll probably leave, i'll probably leave right after you guys okay all right uh can i grab your information are you willing um, to give me that no i don't wish to wait my fourth I amendment as right much. i figured as much but if i could get a cat number or a call number for this um, a... well as soon as we get the report done you're more than welcome to come down and get it sir right. i'm not forcibly removing you from anywhere that sounds good okay let's go out and there and get that stop, number you can, and uh, you can stop down at the station i got that. all uh the information I, I need here. Okay, that's fine. I just, we still have to talk to a couple people here. And then if you want to wait. Hold on one second. Temple. You can um you can stop down and we can give you any report you need, okay? All right. Okay. Thanks for your time. Um All set? Yep. All right. Okay. I'm all set. All right. Thank you. Now, I know you guys don't have a report number, but you guys definitely have a call number on the computer. I'd get that call number now so I can reference this no, easier. You can go down to the station. You can go down.
numbers. You're not going to give that call number out? No, I'll give it to you on the station when we complete the reports. Sir. I have no problem doing that. Well, you said, can I get that call number for well, you? It's the same, same sort of thing. Well, I know, but, but you, you, you guys got a call here on your computer. Right. Yes, you can, foil, you can foil the report, but I'm more than happy to give you the report. Okay? Let's see if I can get that call number you myself. Don't open that door, okay? Let's see if I can't get that call number myself. Since you guys want to not behave and, you okay. know. Thank you. That was a simple request to get that call and number. And you realize, but the report's not complete. You want sufficient evi or evidence of whatever you're doing? We'd be more than happy to provide that. Well, I, all I'm asking for is a call number. It's nice and easy to reference a call number versus Would that. you want the report, though? Well, is yeah, but I can't get that right now. And you agree, I can't get that right now. Sir, I, I was more than happy to help you. Okay, but I think you're being difficult for a purpose. And you're not going to get Ask, Asking for a call number is not difficult. Sir, but that's something to reference this by. I don't. That's why you should just give it to me now. I don't know what it is. You don't have a call number to come here. You know, you get dispatched down here. Not until I get the report done. Okay, I have no problem giving you that report as soon as you come down and get it. Did you mute your body camera while you were in there talking? Everything is on here. Sir, All right, thank you. Okay. <clears throat> is there anything else I can help you with today? No, nah, that's it. Okay, you have yourself a good day. Thank you. You're not recording, are you? Yeah. You can't record in here. I can't hear you. You can't record. No photos or videos in the facility. Really? Are you sure? Yeah. I'm pretty sure I, I'm within the legal. Really? Are, are, are you, um, really? Uh, can I have a dialogue with you? Well, this is, I'm, all I'm doing is I'm an independent journalist, and I'm gathering content for a story on this DMV. So I'm, I'm, this is my fist. Uh -huh. You got to shut that off. Well, this is my First Amendment right, sir. You can't, you not I went, I went through this already in, in the city of Waukegan, and I was, I'm, I'm pretty sure I'm allowed to do what I'm here to do. Oh, Karen. Wow, Karen, right? Yes. Yeah, actually. So it'd be great. You know what? It'd be. Hold on, sir. People's personal information is here. Okay. You can't film it. Would you want somebody filming your personal information? Real quick, Karen. Real quick. Yeah. I understand. Uh, you, you, like you said, we've been through this, correct? Yes. So you are familiar when Waukegan came, they said I had a right to do it. Yes, and he got in <clears> trouble <throat> because he was wrong. Trouble. Because I called the... Bootlicker. Come on. He's uh, now calling the customer's did you, names. Did you hear him call me a jerk? He said something to him. Thank you. Okay. Thank you. But Thank that you. doesn't mean you he answers you can't, back. You can't, I can't answer back. Can't, <laughs> not, wow. You can't record on the property, though. Well, as you can see... And I know when you went to Waukegan, I... We did, I think I one of us I can't remember if it was me. I think I showed up after Waukegan after was, gone. was gone. I don't think you did. After yeah, Waukegan and yeah, you were, you were gone. already I gone. Didn't. You had walked out the back. You were okay. So let me, let me just get this right. What's your name? Shemansky. Officer Shemansky. Are you oh, you're not an officer? He yeah, is an officer. Okay. GBC. Well, I'm just asking. Okay, and what's your badge number? Nine one nine. 919. So you're saying even though Waukegan told me I have a right to do it, which I already know I do, no, by the First Amendment, it's a constitution, this is a public building. I understand, but it's a government facility and they have personal information in there. I'm not recording any personal but information. You, but you can't record in there for the man, zone manager. This is, this. what's amazing is this is the same young lady that was at the other site where she was educated that I could. But I wasn't so there, because I called the chief of police and you can call him in Waukegan and that officer got in trouble because he's incorrect. I also called the court <clears> and a lawyer and he was incorrect. You cannot film inside this building. Really? Really. Even though you was told I could. That's the yeah, part that he I'm... Made, that's... He made a mistake. He, he did not... He, he did... He had... Because no, I asked him where he got the information. Uh -huh. He says, I Googled it. Okay, we got to get back to work. You, you can't record in there. Well, I'm going to come in and record. I'm, no, I'm, you're not. I am. I am definitely am okay. because I have a First Amendment right to do it. You can't... I'm not going to let you guys and friends on my rights. Personal information in the building. And I'm promising not to record people's personal information. You I'm just, just you, I'm just going to stay in the public accessible areas. I'm not going to record any you're computers. You're not in there for business. You can't be in there. I'm in there for business. Thank you. I no, just you're told not. you. 
I am. No, you're not. We had this discussion. I, I am in there. No, this we didn't have this discussion today. What's your name again? I already told you once. What, can you call a supervisor? Because I'm going to come in and record. You, 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 they, you can't come in and record, sir. What, what, can you, what can, like I said, what can you call your supervisor? I tried. I didn't get in touch with him. So what? I'll tell you what. As soon as I get in touch with him, I'll, put, I'll get you his number. Well, how long am I supposed to wait around for that? As soon as I can get in touch with him. Because of now my rights are being infringed on. You I'm not going to allow you, that. You can't come in here and record. They don't, if you're not in here doing Secretary of State business, Karen said you're, they don't want you in here. This is a direct violation of the Constitution, sir. Okay. Well, then you can talk to Deerfield also. See what they have to say. I gave you the opportunity to contact my boss. Yeah, but your boss, I, you talked to him today, right? Your, your sergeant? Yeah. I mean, obviously, he didn't say I was doing anything nefarious or it, it had any ill intent. Why today, don't you right? call my boss if I got his number for you? Like an, I said. It, for what? It's purposeless. What I'm calling him for? Because when you're on the inside, it's Secretary of State property on the inside. State, outside, right? State property. Sec, yeah, state right. property. State right. property. So, what, which makes it public, correct? Can we agree but on when that? When you're in there, when you're in there, I'm not going to agree on anything. When you're oh, in there, there's okay. personal information. Okay. Well, I, well, I'm not recording personal information. But when you're in there, there's personal information given out. I don't know what you're recording. If, Just stand in a public accessible area. If, if you don't have state business, they do not want you in there. State business for driver's license or vehicles. How you doing, officer? Hi. Meeting you or you? You're right with me. You're a sergeant? You're a sergeant? Yes, sir. Oh, okay. What's your name and badge number? Greg Hurry. 3900. All right. I appreciate that. This is the situation, right? I'm here today at the DMV. I'm just exercising my First Amendment right to record in public for a possible publication, a story that I'm working on here. Um, not this young man particularly, but the, another young man in there told me that it's some policy that doesn't allow it. But it's three things with a policy. Policy is not law. Policy doesn't have the force of law. And if I chose to ignore the policy, that's not breaking the law. So I tried to convey that to them. However, they, you know, the level of ineptitude here today is astronomical. Okay. <laughs> I'm just being honest. Okay. You know, I don't have any ill intent, nothing nefarious going yeah. on, sir. Just, just, just right trying to peacefully right. respect, uh, exercise my rights. Several weeks ago, I was at the Waukegan DMV. Okay. And um, a manager by the name of Karen, she she actually works here now, and she she's oh, here. Okay. You know, Waukegan came and educated everyone there that I had the first, I had a First Amendment right to record in public. But okay. told, was, told them to leave me alone, and the same young that. lady is here today trying to infringe again. There was apparently <laughs> some backstory to that that she had mentioned to him I wasn't really familiar with. Okay. Where it's the officer and I, she talked to the chief and yada, yada, yada. But they don't, if, you don't, if you're not there on state business, license, ID, real ID, vehicle stuff, they don't want mm -hmm. you inside. That's okay. just it. I'm here on official business. What's your official business with the state of Illinois other than doing your story, which is an official I'm, business? I'm at work, sir. I'm at work. So am I. And so so, so that's what I'm saying. You can't but infringe on my rights, sir. Here's the Karen here. It's, this is the Karen. Is she Karen. was educated just several weeks ago. And no, in fact, I to wasn't. Know However, can you stop for a minute, please? You have disrupted business in there. You are not disrupt. disrupting business out Hello? here. Can you disrupt business out here? I'm yes, not, you can. I, by, by recording? What, what do we need to finish today? Can, this what, what can this, I help with? This is what I want, you're a law enforcement officer. Yes, sir. Same thing as like I told that young man. It's law enforcement. Uh, yeah, the uniform? Yes. Yeah, the uniform. We don't, we don't want you guys to get in the habit of coming to these public properties and forcing their policy. Because you guys are law enforcement, not policy enforcement. Right, right. So right. you guys sworn oath to uphold the Constitution. Mm -hmm. Me recording in public is part of the Constitution, which is the First Amendment. Unfortunately for them, Fortunately for us, I would love for you to educate these people and let them know that what I'm doing is not illegal. Yeah. So, did, what did you come in here when you're recording? Is that what set alarms yeah, I'm just, off for them? I, yeah, I'm just, I'm just trying to con uh, gather content like for a, a story. Um, how do we resolve today? How do well, can, can, if he's can, not in there, are you, are you done? Are you, I'm or, sorry. Are you done with what you need to do? To be perfectly honest, uh, with that side, because I didn't know it was two sides. I know yeah, uh, that's like drivers and registration. I'm done with that side. I was just going to get 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 a couple more. If you're not in there on business for your license or whatever, you're you're not going inside. And I understand you're working. I get that. I respect that. We're working here, the three of us. You, okay. you can't go in there if you're not in there on state business. Well, then you know if you if you don't allow me to in there, sir, that's infringing on my First Amendment right. It is, and you're doing it right here in front of a law enforcement officer. He's, he's law enforcement too. Yeah, yeah but I'm, I'm just saying, though. I'm just saying. What I'm saying is going to come down on you personally. Not, nothing's going to come down to me in person. It will, sir. No, you're violating not. a clearly established law, sir. You know what that means? Your qualified immunity is out of there. You, okay. That's funny. Okay. You're laughing yeah, at freedom, sir, it and liberties. Funny. 
It is funny. And you're a law enforcement. we've told you, if, wow. you, go in there, you, you if you're not in there for business to get a license, an ID or whatever they can supply you with here, real we ID, heard, ID. I heard you. I heard that. Okay. But, then but if guess what? Me, I don't have to be there. It, apparently. I don't have to be here for that, sir. To go inside, you certainly do. Absolutely not. This is a public building. I'm not going to keep conveying this back and forth. I understand it's a public building. Uh, again? Like I said, again, I'm here Give conducting journalism business. Him, but if, okay. So I'm here. To to line line for Secretary of State he told ago. me to get in the line. Don't cut anymore. I said a line. I, I said this is a disabled senior pregnant woman line. Right. He said you can, something about the line. I could put it in the sales to get right now. That's true. So that's why I'm here. I haven't cut anyone. If you're not conducting Secretary of State business, well, he he just told me something else. Yeah, I got police is here to prove it. Well, he said, as long as I stand in line, I will be good to go. I believe I said they're going to check your documents, and if you're not in there on Secretary That's not what he said. That's not what he said. What documents do you have to show that you have business here? I don't. I do. I have a. I have official business here because I'm recording in public, sir. First Amendment not, right. I don't care about your recording. This is what I don't care about. Well, that's all I'm doing. I'm. I'm a journalism. Okay. I understand you're a journalist. Mm -hmm. But if you're not in here conducting business, you as well, right? Okay. Sir, well, what's your name, sir? Everyone here is doing business. What, here is doing business. What's your name? What's your name? My name is James. What's yours? James what? Just James for now. You don't need my. What's your name? What's your name? Just sergeant. Yes, sir. So there's no, uh, there's no level of professionalism here. You came here being, you want to be, you're a tyrant today, sir. I mean, if you don't have business here, putting on steps, where do you want to go inside? I just told you. Why would keep going over there? Everyone here has has business. That and I do too. Inside. You can't you can't Secretary determine what what I got to do is not business, sir. You can't. Secretary of State business. Yeah, that's why I'm here. What is it? <laughs> to show me the document. Gather the content and disseminate it to the public. Secretary of State's business information. That's exactly why I'm here. So that's all. That's all you're gonna do. That's it. So and you're I, gonna go in there and look at people's information. I'm not gonna look at it in people's information. I'm gonna look what's available to the public and disseminate what? it. Okay. Whatever's exactly. available. What particularly you got pamphlets in there. I can help you out. I get you some pamphlets. I, I don't need to. I'm not disabled, sir. I don't see. I'm not, I'm not broken by the if foot. You were in the disabled line. Well, you got to calculus of ways you can be disabled. I'm not physically disabled. <laughs> oh. Yeah, physically, right? You. Right. There yeah, you go. So we're gonna change. We're gonna change it to accommodate you. I'll, I'll bring out everything you need. I don't need you to. I appreciate it. the gesture, but I don't need. I don't need any help. Okay. I just. I just want to be able to do it unmolested. Unmolested. Yeah. So if you want to, if you want to get a couple pamphlets, you can go inside, get them, get the pamphlets, and come on out. Yeah, if, if you don't, if you don't, need, if you don't conduct any further business, and these employees uh, you know, don't want you there, you're not going to be allowed. To, you're going to have to leave. Yeah, I'm a, I'm like I like I just told this young man in, in Deerfield Police, I, I'm I'm just going to go in there, like I've been trying to do for two hours, gather content. Here's what, how about this? How about and I'm this? leaving. Since you have no business, you're not getting an ID, license, or renewal of any kind, right? Not today. Okay. Why don't, to bypass the line, why don't I go in there? We'll go in there with her. I'll go in there with you together. I don't need you to babysit me, though. I just need you guys' names, badge numbers. I already gave it to you once. I, I just can't pronounce it. I don't want to mess it up. Be I give different. it to you. You can review the tape. Okay, well, let me just get it like this. You don't mind, do you? Yeah, look, look at this guy. Look at this guy. I mentioned my head. <laughs> oh, my God. Shemansky. What's your name again, Sergeant? Espionosa. Did I get it right? You got it perfect. What's your, what's your badge number? 0288. 0228. So I'm just going to file fish complaints on you guys, man, because y'all tried to come here and infringe, man. You talk about babysitting the public, man, while I conduct the First Amendment right. I have, you know, there's no expectation. You, you had no business in here. Well, you weren't going to get an ID uh, license or, uh, I mean, you were going to get pamphlets. I was allowed to get pamphlets. Yeah, but you, obviously someone called you and told you I can do what I can, do, what I had a right to do. No. They had to because you, you, your, your, your whole position changed. But that's okay. Your That's, position changed too. No, it didn't. I said you were in the handicap line. Now you're not the disabled line. Then you said you wanted business, but then you said you just wanted pamphlets. So right. That's gather. I said from the beginning. I said I wanted to gather content. Right. No. Yes, I did. And I'm gathering content for a story on this DMV. And I'm gathering content for a story on this DMV. Yes, I did. It's, it's crazy. But you guys have a nice one, man. All right, man. All, All right. Story. Take care. For sure. Looks like they can hit the car wash a little bit.
I'm not sure if these are I think these are unmarked vehicles I believe Excuse me, did you just say what the f*** are you doing? Yeah, I did. I did. And who are you? What? I am Jeff O'Rourke. I'm investigated the state police want to know why your video videotaped my car. Your car? Is this... Can you, you mind giving me some space, sir? What's your badge number? Shield 3415. You mind uh, keeping six feet? Why? <laughs> because... You can't be all that worried about COVID. You ain't got a mask on. That's what we're worried about? Or are you just trying to intimidate me? I'm not trying to intimidate you. I want to know why somebody's walking around videotaping a car. Well, I, I don't have to answer any questions, especially if you're going to come out like that. All right. Don't give this guy all right. Right. Can I ask who you are? Uh, yeah, investigator Morgan. Morgan? Can I ask what your badge number? It's Shield 2470. Can I Shield 2470? Yep. Can Thank I you for identifying you yourself. Can I ask who you are? Please stay where? I said you can stay over there. <laughs> can I Wait, ask? So now I'm, uh, you're restricting my movement. I'm not restricting anything. You're telling me to stay right here. Anything? This is all public access. Uh, public access. Your, uh, is it not? The parking lot is state police barracks, right? This, the parking lot is, is open to the public, yeah. though. Can I ask? Can I not come in here? I didn't say that, did All I? right, then, so I should be able to walk in the parking lot. Can I, ask, can I ask what your name is? You can ask me whatever you want, but with you, you don't have any professionalism. You came out here talking about what the f are you doing. Yeah, yeah. Okay, you, so you can get the f in my face. How about that? All right. Well, uh, oh, so you, I'll give you my name and badge number. You can't even give me your name? I don't work for the public. I don't I have care. to identify myself. All right. No, you should care. Why should I care? Because if you want my ID or my name, you need reasonable, articulable I, suspicion. No, I don't care. Okay. I don't care what your name is. I I'm know. Just no, you, you, you asked obviously me. don't care about anything. I Technically, asked you, you asked me. You know why? Because you came out here rude. Oh, rude. It's not rude to shove a camera in somebody's face, though. I'm shoving a dude. You came up to me. So, you questioned me. You okay? came here. And my camera was up in your face. You came here. And I have a right to. Yeah. You doing? I got the okay. right to ask your name. You can ask me whatever you want, but you don't have the right to sit right. there and talk to citizens color? like that. You understand? You understand? I don't need to learn anything. Man, you're you. dismissed. What's your favorite color? You're dismissed. dismissed. You're dismissed. You're dismissed. You're dismissed. Is there anything else I you need? All day. Is there anything? I know because you're a clown. Yeah. Oh, I'm a clown. Yeah. You're so out so here. so. Who do you work you're for? You're who do you work for? You're sitting Who do you work for? Funny little hat. Who do you work for? I'm a clown. Who do you work for? Nice hat, dude. Thank you. That's cap, yo. Cap, yo. Is that what they say? That cap. I don't know. It depends. Is that what the clowns say? Yeah. I don't know. Apparently clowns okay. walk around with cameras with funny hats on. Oh, that's what they do, huh? Yeah, that's, that's what, what clowns do. do? That's what I think they do. Interesting. Oh, that's, that's, what, that's what you what think. think okay. You, you don't got clowns. nothing better to do than harass citizens? Because right now you're harassing me. I kind of feel like you're harassing me. I'm harassing you when you approach me? You came to my uh, place Oh, you're a employment. tyrant, bro. So? I'll place. go inside to your place of employment, eh? And? Yeah. What's it's the problem? Open. And? Door open. Door and? Open. Which one's your car? Uh, this one right here. Uh, yeah, this has got to be your car. this one is. Yeah, because you came out here unprofessional yep. swearing at a citizen yeah and you on the clock right that's true absolutely on the clock too eight to four yeah eight to four so what you got hiding here that you so that you you want to hide something there's no expectation of privacy in public remember that you should know that you should know that is your inspection up to date mm, i don't know Yep, it is good. Just barely. Yeah, it looks it. Oh, yeah. I better get on that. Yeah, you should. Yeah. Probably should. Especially if it's, it's August. Look, you got to renew that this month, huh? No, no, no. The state takes care oh, of it. Oh, okay. Oh, the state takes care of it. Oh, you got to do it. Or, or the, the public takes care of it. Which one? Ah. Uh, is, like, is this personal? Technically. Is this your personal vehicle? No, no. It's a state car. Oh, it's a state. So, yeah. So, we pay for that. Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah, I we pay too. for that. I do, too. I pay no, you're just too. a welfare recipient. I'm a welfare That's all you are, really. Do you have a problem with welfare? No, not at all. Why do you hate welfare? Who said I hate anything? Don't put words in my mouth. Yeah. I'm just telling you. You say I'm welfare. You say you work, but technically you're just collecting welfare yeah. checks. That's all you're doing. And there ain't nothing wrong with so that. police investigator's paycheck is... From the taxpayers, right? Check. That's a welfare I'm just saying. I pay my own tax. All right. You have fun walking around. Yeah, you too, man. I'm sure you'll get bored. Yeah, oh, actually, can I speak to your supervisor? Sure. Yeah, have right. him come out, please. Go push the button right there. What's the supervisor's name? Carlos Delgado. Delgado? Stay police the center. This is a call from the ADC. Yes, um, you didn't actually tell me what was going on. Am I waiting for somebody? Like, because I'm outside, and it is hot outside. Are you there, sir? Of course I'm here. I, I just told you. There's an automated message when the phone picks up. So you're talking and there's a machine over you. I can't hear you. I don't know what to tell you then. Can you please have someone come out? I need a state trooper to come outside. You're at the SP Princetown 
building, right? Um, on Route 7 in Dwaynesburg? Yes. Okay, somebody was on their way outside. I hope so. Thank you. May I, may I ask who I'm speaking to? So who am I speaking to? But you're the one that's assisting me, and I want to know who's assisting me. It's Dispatcher Kayazo, like I said when I answered. Uh, well, I didn't catch that. No need to be rude. So, you know, like you said, there's interference, so I might not have heard you. So, Kayazo? Yeah, okay, thank you. So, who am I talking to? That is irrelevant, but thank you for your time. I'll be waiting for them. Can you identify yourself, please? Yeah, Deputy Jones. How you doing? Deputy Jones? Yeah. How you doing? I'm good. I'm all right. Are you good? I'm good. I'm awesome. Sorry. I'm just wondering why you're walking back from the station, that's all. So. Yeah, you could wonder. Oh, you want, I guess. I can't hold that against you, right? Uh, no, you can't. <laughs> uh, what's your um, badge number? 281. 281? Yeah. Deputy Jones. That's me. Awesome. So, are you the under deputy? I'm a deputy sheriff. Okay, you're so so everybody's called deputy sheriff. Yes. Okay, yep. got it. All right. I yeah. thought deputy was uh for the person who was under no, the sheriff. No, no, that'd be like that'd be like the under sheriff. Right. No, I yeah. knew that. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Okay. Awesome. So, no, Other than that, these are all you know the sheriff. So you know. How are you today? I can't complain, man. You know, gorgeous day out. How you doing? Not bad. What's that? Not bad. Yeah. So uh. The reason why you calling out to me, man? Yeah, because I saw you walking back around their station. That's so, all. You know, I just thought it was a little weird. Weird. So, yeah. Is that a crime or something, no. or? No, but I have the right to inquire. So. Okay. Inquire, that's all, right. all. You know what I mean? So, uh, oh, hold on a second. Let's yeah, put, let's put that on pause because yeah. it looks like you got someone else here. Yeah. Deputy Jones. Hello. How are you? K9 unit. K904. Can you identify yourself, please? You're all set. Can you identify yourself? Member of the public is asking you, it's your policy to aren't identify you yourself. You're trespassing, aren't you? No, not at all. You're not trespassing? So, you want to identify yourself, deputy? No, you talk to this. Right here is my name. But you came here. So right right here, here is your, that's not professional. That's my name. I'm sorry. not a good reader. Can you pronounce it for me? Riel. Okay. Riel, badge oh, number? Talk to him. Badge uh, number? 362, it's right here. Three, six, okay, it's right here. No professionalism at all, huh? Yeah. You don't very, want to verbalize it? No, He's no, not at all. Not at all. I, I, yeah, okay, that's fine. Here, just do me a favor. Just step away from my car like that, please. Can you? Whoa! Please step away from my car like that. Don't touch me ever no, again. Step away from don't my car like that, then. Okay. You, what, so, what, I can walk to your car. No, yeah, that's this fine. This is paid by the taxpayers. You're, you're not walking up to my my driver's side door like that. I can walk to any part of the vehicle. You're not doing it, bro. Do so, not put your hands on me no, again. Step away from the car. Then. Don't put your hands on me again. You understand I'm sorry, that, right? What are you, saying, John? you are not allowed to put your hands on people. You do not have my consent. Yeah. Yeah, I think they're talking about me. Something about a photo. We all set? Okay. Yo, who do I talk to? Uh, your, well, who's your sheriff? D'Agostino? Yep. All right, I'm going to talk to him about you putting your hands on me. Absolutely. Clown. Excuse me, sir. <clears throat> no, not you, sir. Sir, are you the, uh, are you the sergeant, lieutenant? No, I'm a sergeant. Sergeant, can I speak to you for a minute, please? Yeah, yeah. It's about the conduct of, of this gentleman right over here. I'm over here filming, which I have a right to do, yes, and do. he comes up to me. Hey, stop. Talk about me. I am. Hey, stop. Talk about me. I am. You see, look at the unprofessionalism. Can you identify yourself, please, yeah. Sarge? Sergeant Marshall. Sergeant, I'm sorry. Marshall. Marshall. Yep. Okay, uh, do you have a, a, a badge number? Yeah, 5456. 5456? Five, five, yeah. Okay, so um, do you have like a business card or something like that? Because I want to file a formal complaint. That gentleman, what is his name again? Uh, that's Investigator O'Rourke. O'Roy? O'Roy? Yep. O'Rory? Okay, okay well, so he's the one that file, comes out. Do you want to file a complaint? Yes, I do, because he comes out and he curses at me. Okay, which is completely un unprofessional. Hey, you know All right, yeah. he talked. Excuse me, I am yeah, speaking. Right. Stop am, am, being am, am, rude. Hey, uh, Come on, can you put him? Can you control? Can you control him, please? Can you please control him? Do you hear him? I'm trying to make a complaint, and he's telling you to ignore me. Do you hear that, right? Do you hear that, Sarge? Eventually, he'll get a job. Do you hear this? This is unacceptable. All right, this is clearly discrimination for what? I, I don't know. Why don't you help me figure it out? Is it because I'm filming? Is it because I'm colored or something like that? For him to come up to me and swear at me and talk down to me? Uh, mock my attire? Is that okay, Sarge? Because he's representing you guys. Okay? I would like. I, I would like to do that, yes. Because this is unacceptable. I would like... Uh, who who um, is the head of this department? State police? Yes, who is the head of the state police here? Who is the superintendent here, correct? Superintendent is uh, 
Ruin. Ruin? Yep. First name? Kevin. Kevin Ruin? And he's the super in, superintendent. Yeah. Okay. I would like his information. That way I can, uh, if I need to. I'm going to give you all that information. Perfect. Let's go take a look inside at the State of New Hampshire Department of Health and Human Services, Manchester, New Hampshire District Office, and exercise our rights. Possibly pull some records and uh, get some public information. Go ahead, sir. Oh, thank you. Yeah, no problem. Appreciate it. Yes. Hi. Hi. Is there a reason why you're taking pictures? Uh, yeah, there's always a reason. Yep. Okay, great. What is that reason? Please? I'm not going to give you that information. I'm sorry? We're not agreeing to you taking our pictures. You don't have any authority over that. We have authority over you taking our pictures. Yes, if, of course you don't. No, this is a public building. Yeah. Can I have your name? No name? Do you have a business card? There you go. I have people I have to call to the way. Yeah, go ahead and I'll back up out of your way. Okay, yeah, I won't stop you from doing your job. Okay. No problem. Sorry. People are up here giving confidential yep, information. HIPAA? You speaking of HIPAA, right? Yes. Yeah, that's on you. That's the onus is on you to protect that information. That's right, which is why we are asking you yeah. not to record people in this building. But because what I'm telling you is they I, are private citizens and their no, they're information not private citizens. is confidential. We're in a public area. Yes, and we HIPAA, are. And HIPAA laws and policies reflect on you, not me. It is up to you to protect that information. Do you not feel that people have a right to the protect the privacy of their information? That's on you to protect that information. I'm sorry, you're right. not allowed to tape in here. Is this a public facility? You're not allowed to tape in here. This is a security area. You're this is not a security area. This is a public area, ma'am. I have every right to be in here. I have every right to record. They're worried about HIPAA, okay, which I understand. Yes. But you need to understand oh. that those laws and policy are on you to protect, not me. I am trying to protect it. That's okay. why I'm asking you to not. No, to that's not how you protect it. How you protect it is by not giving that information out, by not having them give it to you verbally, and to protect all the information, all the paperwork, and everything in the back of it. That's how you protect it. You're making everyone desperately uncomfortable, and okay. I'm going to call the police, okay? Well, I'm sorry to... You know, I mean, it, no, I have a right to be here. I'm, I'm not worried about them. Know. They're going to tell you. Perfect. They're going to tell you exactly mm -hmm. what I told you. Okay. And I'm going to remain here when they leave, too. They probably won't even respond. They know better. That's okay. I'll call. Thank All you right. so much. All right. Have fun. Hey, what's going on, man? What's up, dude? I've been waiting for you. Why is that? Well, because they said that they were calling you, so I didn't yeah. just, I didn't want to run away. So you what's, know? Your, what's the point of being here right now, man? Like, what's what's your ultimate goal? Well, first of all, do you have a name, badge number? Yeah, it's Gagne 153. Uh, how do you spell that? G-A-G-N-E. If you awesome. can't pronounce oh, it. Oh, Gagne. Point. No, it's Gagne. Oh, Gagne. Okay. okay. That's why I asked. All right. Cool. If you can't um, pronounce that, I think of Kanye by Kanye. Okay. okay. Yeah, yeah. So honestly, what? Are what's you going recording? On? I am recording. Okay. Were you going to tell me that? Yes, or? I was going to, but you okay. just asked me for my badge number first before okay. I even started. Okay, okay. Man. Cool. Do you have any idea on you? For what? So I know who I'm talking to. You uh, just ask who I am. No, I don't. You're you're a public servant. All right, man. that's fine. So what's yeah. the point of being here right now? I'm filming, recording, documenting, exercising my rights, and getting uh, public this, information. This is private property. No, this is actually state property. No, it's not. Okay, they own this building. You can go outside into the parking lot and do whatever you want, but this is owned by the Department of Human Services. Which is state, property. right? Public. And you're not supposed to be here. This is not public property. They've asked you time and time again. I'm asking you a question. What's okay, that? let's get to an understanding. Let's deescalate, okay, and come to an understanding. This is public property, state property, correct? This building. Yes. This department right here. A public lobby, correct? This is this no. a public lobby? No. Who's, whose lobby is it? Department of Human Services. Which is state so, and city and public why? property, correct? So when I get a call... Over this here, is not private property. So let's restart this, okay? okay? yeah. My call comes over here. Yeah. Saying there's a guy that fits your description. Yeah. White male, face mask, yeah. everything like that, recording, screaming okay. at people. Oh, I'm not screaming. Did you raise your voice at all? I'm not going to answer any questions like that. Why not? Because I have a right to remain silent right. if I need to. I'm not going to so incriminate you're myself. Making, you're disorderly over here. I'm disorderly? You're causing... By asking... You don't even... Yes, I do know. You You've do. You've been demanding 
documentation from them, right? I'm asking for their names. I'm asking for the services they provide. I'm asking for business cards. I'm asking for emails. And they haven't given you a business card? No, and that's fine. If they want to act that way and look unprofessional working for the public, then that's fine. They can do that. I'm going to request a supervisor, please. You would like a supervisor? Yes, I would. Just like you asked, my supervisor. Right awesome. Now. How are you doing? I'm here asking basic questions, okay? Trying to get public information, um, see how they kind of conduct their business here. Um, they're crying HIPAA, 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 okay? And I tried telling them very nicely that the onus is on them, okay, to protect that information not on me. So I can't legally violate HIPAA laws. Um, they don't want to give me the information I'm asking, okay, which is just, I mean, it looks bad on them. And that's it. I mean, if they don't want to give it to me, I'm not going to yell and bang on the window. It's not going to get me anywhere, right? It's going to get me disorderly. And you know I know what I'm doing, man. So, yeah, well, that's tough shit, isn't it? So, it is. So he was telling me that this is private property when this is definitely considered state property, city property, okay, which is, yes, I do. I'm video recording, I'm exercising my rights. Are you asking me to leave? Yes. If I don't leave, I'll be under arrest. So you're gonna to threaten to arrest me if I don't leave this public building? You have For, no business no this is my business. That's, that's not, that's I have not every right to come in here and record silently, okay? And not bother anybody, which is exactly you're, what I'm you're doing. Bothering several people, though, well, no, several they, that's how they narrate the story, so, so, so to get to, to get a response so, here. So at this point, we're gonna give you a lawful order to leave. You're gonna give me a lawful order to leave. Yes, sir. Under what under what threat? For disorderly for, conduct. So and being disorderly in the, in the public place. I'm being disorderly conduct, huh? Yeah. And do you have any proof of that? Speaking with the supervisor. There. Lavalley, you really want to pull this card? The, the proof is... No. Do you really want to pull this card? I'm over here. Lavalley, look. Listen, okay? You know exactly who I am and what I do. I do. Okay? I, do. I know exactly what the laws are, okay? I know the ordinances. I know a lot more than you guys think I do, okay? okay? This is to test you and to test them, okay. all right? I'm not in there being disorderly. They just don't like my camera. It's discrimination, okay? I'm not is in there... camera? Yeah, they said stop recording. You need to leave. Okay by just simply asking them questions. Okay. And they don't like that, and they don't understand the laws. And you, okay, as a sergeant, should go in there and literally tell them, what he has every right to I'm be in here. I'm tell him, but I'll go talk. Here, okay, I'm still talking to LaValle. I'll just stay arrested. No, I'll All take right. the arrest. No. Yeah, I will. Stay out of the building. No, no, I'll take the arrest. I have every right to go back in there. I'll take the arrest. Disorderly conduct. Right to go back in there. They don't want you in there, you don't have I don't get what they want they don't have it's any, not up to them it's not up to them clark i'm getting public information i'm asking them simple questions you don't about have this a legitimate reason to be in the business i need to make i already made an appointment this, this, okay i already made an appointment i have legitimate business the supervisor does not want you well here. i don't care what you want excuse me no move out of my way i'm not moving out of your you're way. going to move out of my way i'm not moving out of your way do i have to force myself by you you are not forcing yourself <laughs> no why, well, are you going to beat me up and throw nope. me in the back? Not at all. But no? Not coming into Do you guys want another lawsuit? Is that what you want? We would we're like doing you to our job. Away, well, we like. I'm not listening to you. Okay. Because you have no lawful authority to tell me what to do. The supervisor does not want you here. I don't care what the supervisor okay. wants. You're causing a disorderly right now. No. Doing my job. No, you're, you're not. Call you're call violating my rights. No. And you're not going to flank me. Flank you. Yeah, you did. Excuse me, sir. No. Excuse me, sir. No. They I'd like to go. They don't have any authority to tell me I can't be in here. You don't have any legitimate. Authority. I do. I made an appointment. It's on the screen. Go look at it. When, is you, when did you make that appointment? At like, I don't know, 12 o'clock, 12.02, I think it was. They don't want you here. Yeah, well, you said I have no legitimate business. I have an appointment for questions. You're not coming in. Yes, I am. No, I'll take the arrest when you leave. You're not coming I don't in. care. I'll take the arrest. Put the cuffs on me now, dude. <laughs> you think I won't do it? We just need you to go. No. I'm not leaving. You're not going to make me leave. Unless I'm in cuffs and you violate my rights and you're on notice, so there goes your qualified immunity. Yeah. Yeah. Excuse me, sir. You're not going in. Yeah, you are. I am. Excuse me, sir. No. Excuse me, sir. Nope. You're restricting my rights into a public building? You're not going in. I don't want you in there. Oh, well, that's tough. You can't tell me I can't go in there. I'm trying to get some public records. I'm trying to pull some information. For the public, People I'm trying to. You can, you can take. I'm not even talking to you. Okay. Talking to him. <laughs> well, I'm telling you, you're not coming in. Okay. Well, when you leave, I'll go back in. If you want to come back and arrest me, you can. 
Oh, well, you could just yeah. move out of my way. I'm not moving out of your way. That would be nice if you did. Yeah, You're right. violating my rights right now, sir. You're not moving. Yeah. You're violating my rights, sir. No, yeah, you are. No, they don't want you in here. Supervisor, you request a supervisor. He's going in there. He's speaking mm -hmm. with them. Okay. okay. We'll see what he says when he comes out. Mm -hmm. Sir, I'd like to. I have an appointment made in the La Valley. All right, sir. Like we I'll talk to the sergeant. To I'll talk to the sergeant. All right, go ahead. You can. You can talk you. To the what time's your appointment? I think I made it at like twelve oh two. It's just to ask questions. So I wanted to ask questions. So you, I. You signed in. Under your I did. Name? Yeah. Under your name. Under whose name? Yours. I don't answer those type of questions. Do I have to? I have to give up my right now to ask questions? I asked you a question. Did you sign in under your name? Do I have to? Or did you sign in under a different name? Do I have to? So who, who made this appointment with you? What do you mean? Who ma Nobody made an appointment. Okay. They're, what they're doing is they're restricting me access to asking them basic questions about what they do here, their emails, their phone numbers, okay, well, business well, cards. People are giving private information. Yeah, it's HIPAA. They I understand that. Be recorded? No, it, it can't. Yeah, you're, you know what? I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna lie. You are correct, 100. Yeah. percent But let me explain HIPAA to you, okay? HIPAA is the onus is on them to protect that information, okay? Exactly. It is on them. I cannot legally violate HIPAA laws. Okay, but they have certain I, questions. I can't. They, have to obtain certain information. they need to create the privacy in a public area. That's what they need to do. And they started to do that, which is great. Are you still going to restrict me from this? Yes. I'm not talking to you. I'm talking to the sergeant. He's in charge here, okay. along with me. I'm sure he's going to tell you the same thing. Okay. Well, let him speak for himself. He's a big boy, isn't he? As of right now, I'm going to go around the corner. While I'm waiting for them, I'll go look in their windows. My mere presence with the camera is not considered disorderly conduct. I know that's your go-to charge, but it's not going to work. Oh, there they are. Let's go take a look at their vehicles. Mind if I search your vehicle? Absolutely not. No? You know what the plain view doctrine is? We're going to exercise that today. It is locked and secure, right? I'm not going to check. I just want to see. I'll let you guys walk in front of me. Go ahead. No, 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 I don't think so. I thought you were in charge. Oh, I am in charge. <laughs> <laughs> so if I don't leave the property, you're going to throw me under arrest? Yes. Um, I'm not. I'm talking to the Sarge. I'm giving you a lawful order. Leave, okay. You have and, no legitimate business here. Okay. What would be the crime? What would you arrest me for? Just so I know, for the record. Disorderly I'm talking to the sergeant. Giving you a lawful order and you refuse to leave. I'm not refusing to leave. I will leave the okay. property. Okay. All right. But I need to know what charges you would... So trespassing and disorderly? Disorderly conduct. And trespassing? No. Just disorderly conduct? Just disorderly conduct. I'm giving you a lawful okay. order to leave. All right. Huh. So where do I leave? Just get off the property. Well, I don't... Yeah, where are you going? Like over there? You want to walk sure, in the street? Stay out of the roadway. Stay out of yeah. the roadway? Okay. Yeah, but I have to... Yeah, I have to walk against traffic, right? You is that the law? the road and you can walk on the opposite Did side. Drive her in a car? I don't answer those type of questions. Well, you probably get in a car in I don't have, I parachuted in. Yeah. Okay, yeah. Just okay. All right. We all good? Yep. Can I walk you back to your vehicles and then, uh... Please do. All right. Is that the easement? Right? Easement? The easement? Yeah. So I have to go on the easement public property? No, no different no. than this building, right? Yep. All right. But I could stay on the property? No. I can't go on the pro When can I come back? Make an appointment. So I have to make an appointment to come back? You have a legitimate purpose to be here, I guess, right? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Cool.